This is my chess games for August the 11th and as you can see I'm doing quite well over here with only one mistakes and three inaccuracies and there you go we got uh, my opponent has couple blunders and we'll see that soon e4 is a book move and I've been doing this one over here and I'm happy to say that I'm getting better at this thing right here. Modern defense. Uh -huh. Now this is new. Usually they would develop the pieces over here and attack this pawn over here eventually by moving the knights over here and then take this one and attack the queen and if I castle here attack the rook over here the castling here is rather premature usually I would uh, move the knights over here and then the pawn over here and then either the pawn takes or the pawn can move forward over here. The computer usually says take that pawn if available but I usually just move the pawn over here up there. Anyway, next move. And as you can see the knights aiming for that pawn so it can attack the fork over here but I have the bishop over here that that means the knight cannot go here otherwise it will block that one and yes it will fork the knight happen a few times and well I've learned to watch for it so I'm fine right now Oh, there's a better way. Uh, let's see what happens. Aha, that one over there. I will ignore that. I will ignore that move. So... And that's a mistake right there because you can see that pawn is hanging right there. So the only way to defend it is by pieces. And well, that's a weak point right there. So that will be my focus next. As you can see, since the knight is blocking the bishop over here, the pawn becomes a weak point. But this is a mistake right here. I can actually take the pawn right here immediately. And the only way for that to happen is like the rook takes the knight and then bishop takes rook. And by the way, this one's protected already. So that's actually a mistake. How can I capitalize the mistake? Is the nice point over here. So this, this is a very interesting position here. Next move. And this is a very, very interesting move over here because like I said, I could have taken the pawn with the knight, but why does the queen move there? And the reason for that is because the queen protects the pawn. At least that's how I pretended to do. But the real point for the queen is to attack this pawn over here, and then the rook takes this pawn over here. So that's 
actually my goal over here so that's the goal and of course as the pawn move forward attacking the bishop then that's going to be a double move the bishop has to be protected somehow and then the queen just takes the pawn very interesting very interesting move over here and what just blunders into it that's obviously a mistake and it's a great move of course our independent material but interestingly enough I waited for the queen to move here before I take the pawn next move And again, what doesn't know what I was aiming for? Keep forgetting that, yes, the pawn is there available for the taking. So that's a mistake right there. There's a better way to attack a piece. Uh, and that's a very interesting point right there. I'm thinking the knight can just take that one over there and that one over there, but it's interesting. There you go. And there you go. So, yep, so that's interesting one. And this is like a rather indirect way to attack that one, but basically, yes, the bishop is going to be taking the rook over there so I have a good combination pieces right here and this is very interesting over here not exactly useful but interesting I could have won the material over here by pawn take bishop, but again, my goal is to have the bishop takes the rook. Hopefully, it will cause him to resign immediately, but um, I guess that's not really true, is it? And yep, that's. And that would be a good way to do it too. But my way is more interesting, so take that one. And by this time I have a good evaluation right here. Mm, 7.8, so that's obviously a very good evaluation. And that is a mistake. This loss of force check made in two. And that it is. And it should be called a blunder really because Yep, because uh, that's the way to do it. Uh, so really I would call that a blunder. And of course, queen takes rook, and if queen takes queen, rook takes queen, and mid. That's it. And that's the way it is. <coughs> 